Hi everyone, welcome to episode 4 of my golf fitness series and today I'm going to be sharing with you 5 exercises that you can do to help loosen your shoulders and increase range of motion in your golf swing. So all of these exercises I've done in the past to help me warm up for a tournament round and has really made a big difference uh, without me having to hit a bunch of balls, especially for early morning tea times. And if you like this video, please remember to give it a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already to see more golf content in the future. Let's get into it. For the first exercise, you will need a foam roller. You will place it in front of you and push one of your arms along the roller so that you are twisting your torso and lowering the shoulder to feel a stretch in your lats and rear delts. You will hold the stretch for a moment and perform 10 reps on each side for as many that you feel you need to get loose. Uh, if you don't have a foam roller, you can just reach past your armpit as far as you can. This next exercise is one of my favorites and you will need a golf ball. Uh, first lay on your back and place the ball onto your rear delt and while keeping constant pressure on the rear part of the shoulder you will move your arm around, up and down, you can internally and externally rotate your arm and this will really help to prime your shoulders to be able to move in different directions. If you feel like a golf ball is too harsh on your shoulders then you can substitute it with a squash ball or something that is softer. The next exercise is called a shoulder ball smash. So you just need to place a golf ball against the wall and basically rub your shoulder against it. So you can move the ball side to side, up and down, in circles. Uh, this is just a good way to get rid of any tightness. So again, if you feel like a golf ball is too harsh, then you can use something that is softer. Uh, you can do this for about 30 seconds on each side. Next, we have a external rotation stretch. You will hold your golf club in one hand and start out by raising your right hand as if you are going to say hi. Then place the shaft behind your shoulder and gently grab onto the club with your right hand. This exercise is really helpful for a lot of golfers because this movement can play a big role in your swing mechanics. However, you must be cautious with this exercise. You do not want to overstretch because you may injure your shoulder, so make sure to do this very gently. From here, you will gently externally rotate your arm. So you only need to hold the stretch for a brief moment before relaxing. Another thing to keep in mind is that you want to ensure that your elbow stays in front of your shoulder. If it gets behind your shoulder, then uh, you, you may cause injury. So you will do this for about 30 seconds on each side. And finally, the last exercise is a chest and front delt stretch. This is really good to help increase depth and height in your backswing. But you will place one foot closer to the wall and hold one arm at 90 degrees against the wall and slowly lean forward. You should feel a good stretch in your chest. Uh, as you are leaning into the uh, stretch, you can try and turn your chest away from the wall to deepen uh, the stretch further. Okay, thanks for watching everyone. Uh, so those were some of the, my favorite exercises to help me warm up before a round of golf and also improve your mobility in your swing as well. So if you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. Uh, but other than that, I will see you on the next one.